Hi, so today I'm doing a tutorial using Urban Decay's Summer of Love palette. I really enjoy this palette. If you don't have it, I highly recommend it. I got it from the Urban Decay website, but they might have it at Sephora or even on Sephora's website. A lot of these colors you can find in other palettes, or you might also just have a single shadow. So I'm going to name them off for you. The colors are Flash, Maui Waui, Chopper, and Smog. And the 24-7 eyeliner pencil in Bourbon, which is kind of a brownish color. And Primer Potion in Sin also comes in with this. So if you don't have those colors and you don't have them in other palettes, there's definitely duplicates out there. I know at drugstores and things. It's a very nice, warm, bronzy-ish type look and would be great for a cookout that's going to go into the night or just any type of occasion really for summer. It's very summery. I love it. This is how it looks. I hope you like it as much as I do and please excuse my nails. I know I have to change my nail polish <laughs> because it's chipping off. So I hope you enjoy it. On with the tutorial. <laughs> So take a larger shader brush, okay, it's not very large, but it's like, like a medium size. I think this one is considered the larger one. And bring that one into the color Maui Waui, which is this color right here. And you're going to put that in the inner corner of your eye. Just like that. And bring it down into the very corner and toward the bottom under here and using the same brush you're going to go into the color chopper which is right here and that's going to be your lid color but you're going to put it in the very middle don't take it all the way out to the outer corner, just put it in the middle. With the blending brush, this is kind of a smaller, harder type blending brush. Sorry, excuse my fingernails. With the blending brush, you're going to go into the color Smog, which is right here. And you're going to put this in the outer corner. Smog will just give it the shadowing effect and bring it up into the crease and on the brow bone. Somewhat, I guess like under, sort of on the brow bone. Now, that color you can make darker. So if it's not dark enough for you, you can always just go back in and shade over it again. If it comes out too dark, just keep blending it in and that should lighten it up a little bit on the color. Then we're gonna take our liner brush and we're gonna go into the color Maui Waui. It's right there. And we're going to take that in back into the inner corner, just in case we didn't get too much there with the shadow brush. Using the same brush, we're going to go into the color Smog. And we're going to take this in the outer corner. We're going to connect them outer corner and under on your lash line just kind of connect it don't bring it all the way in just bring it about a third of the way in using the same brush again we're going to go into the color flash which is the purple color And we're going to connect Maui Waui and Smog using the color Flash. So just put Flash right in between those two colors on the lower lash line. Just like that. 
So it's sort of a bronzy look, but with a hint of purple. Now we're going to take the liner that comes with this palette, which is 24-7 in bourbon. And we're going to line the waterline. Then we're going to curl our lashes. And then we're going to use Lash Blast. I'm using waterproof, but you can use, you know, waterproof or non-waterproof. Actually, you could probably use any mascara. This is in brownish black. If I use black, my lash, since my lashes are black, it just makes it extremely bold. And I don't want this to be too bold, at least not today. So that's why I'm going with the brownish black. And I'm just doing under my lashes. I'm not going above them. And then take what's left and put it on your lower lashes. Now what I like to do is I like to take a clean brush any clean brush and just kind of brush away the little glitters or any other colors or anything that may have fallen. Just kind of clean it up a little bit. I'm just using this brush to do it. Any clean brush pretty much should do the trick. Now this is a shimmery look. There probably will be um, some little shimmers that fall down. So um, that's pretty much it, and um, this is the look. You can top it off with a more natural looking lip, which is probably what I would do. I have clear gloss on right now, and that works just as well. I hope you like the look. I hope you try it. I will see you soon. Bye.